cameras, lenses. Yeah. Do those? How much do those matter? You mentioned director of photography. What? What's your? How much do you love the the feel, the smell of equipment that does the visual filming? You know, there's some people yeah. they're just like, <sighs> they. Yeah. They, they love lenses. How much do you love that? and Or versus how much do you focus on the story or the access and all those kinds of things? I'm not a tech geek, um, but because during the bulk of my career, I, um, I've i worked as a director of photography myself for other people in order to pay the bills over the years. Um, you know, I know the technical side of it because I I've had to know it and I've had to train myself and learn it. So I see them as necessary tools. And again, because I believe, you know, film and cinema is, is and should be visually driven and not verbally driven, um, I want the best tools possible within my means, right? And within the, the logistical ability of the project, because we have to go so small, right? I can't, I can't afford, nor can I bring a huge hundred thousand dollar lens. So if I give you a trillion dollars, a trillion dollars, yeah, wow, so unlimited, yeah. So there's still huge constraints that have nothing to do with money, yeah, like you just said. Yeah. So what what cameras would you use? You know what I do with the trillion dollars? <laughs> I can do a lot. You're not allowed. Dollars, yeah. You're only allowed <laughs> to fund the film and no corrupt stuff where you like (laughs) use the film to actually help children. No, you're not allowed to do any of that. (laughs) What I would do with the children is I wouldn't invest in it. Well, I guess I would invest in, I would, I would increase capacity to do more films. What I would do. So I would buy basically the perfect little, you know, mini equipment set. Right. But then I would train three teams maybe to do the same thing that I've been doing so we could multiply and scale Collect up. more and more stories. Yeah, that's what I would do with the money. But the actual setup? Would remain small and nimble, yeah. And uh, what about lighting? Do you usually use natural light? Do you ever do, um, I mean, sorry for the technical questions here, but um, highlighting the drama of the human face. Yeah. Uh, that's the visual, that's art. That's yeah. like to, to reveal reality yeah. uh, at its deepest is art. And uh, do you use lighting? Well, lighting is such a big part of that. Yeah. Do, you use, do you ever do artificial lighting? Do you try to do natural always? You know the best lighting instrument in the world? Is the, the sun. sun at the right moment of the day. And so I predominantly use natural light. Um, at certain moments um, and just shape natural light yes. um, during the course of these small human rights talks. That's not to say we don't bring instruments sometimes, but when we do, they're very small and again, uh, compact. So for example, I have this small little um, yeah, tube kit that's just three instruments, right? That you can charge with the USB because electricity is often a major issue where we go. Mm-hmm. So there's just three little tube lights with magnetic backs that if we find in a situation where, you know, we can't get enough exposure for a hallway or something and we have the time to throw it up, we'll throw it up if people are walking, if if collaborators are walking down that hallway a lot, for example, at night, just so we can see them, right? Yeah. So it's instances like that. Or if we do do an interview, which we don't do very often, but if we do, just so we have a, a key light on the face, mm-hmm. right? Um, and I'll always bring in a reflector or two, you know, just to shape natural light as well in ways. But it's um, it's about shaping rather than producing light for us. Got it. As we sit surrounded by black by curtains one, in complete two, natural three, light. Four, yeah. So <laughs> just, just so you know, this room... Uh, is is like a violation of the basic principles of of using the sun. So <laughs> behind the large curtains are giant windows. Yeah. So this whole should I rip them open? Should <laughs> yeah, exactly. I rip open the curtains? 